Hello students! Welcome to Math and Magic. For this video, we're going to solve quadratic equations by extraction of square root. Recall that quadratic equation is a second degree equation. Its standard form is given by ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0, where a is the numerical coefficient of the quadratic term, b is the numerical coefficient of the linear term, and c is a constant. Extraction of square root is said to be the simplest method of solving a quadratic equation. It is typically used when the linear term of the equation is missing. Say for example, we are asked to solve the quadratic equation x squared minus 100 equals 0. What we need to do first is to isolate the variable x. We may add 100 on both sides of the equation or transpose negative 100 to the right side so that it will now become x squared equals positive 100. Next, get the square root of both sides. So the square root of x squared is x. The square root of 100 are positive and negative 10. Hence, the roots of this quadratic equation are positive and negative 10. For our second example, say find the roots of 2x squared minus 160 equals 2. Following the steps presented earlier, first we need to isolate the term with the variable x. So we can now add 160 on both sides. It is now 2x squared. Negative 160 plus 160 is 0. Positive 2 plus 160 is equal to 162. Then we now have 2x squared equals 162. Next, we divide both sides by 2 since that is the numerical coefficient of the quadratic term. So we now have x squared equals 162 divided by 2 is 81. Getting the square root of both sides of the equation, we have x equals positive and negative 9. The roots of this quadratic equation are positive and negative 9. Another example, solve the equation twice the square of quantity x plus 3 plus 3 equals 35. Adding negative 3 on both sides of this quadratic equation gives us 2 times the square of quantity x plus 3 equals 35 minus 3 or 32. Dividing both sides by 2 gives us the square of quantity x plus 3 equals 16. Getting the square root of both sides, we have x plus 3 equals positive negative 4. Adding negative 3 on both sides of the equation gives us the values of x of negative 3 plus 4 and negative 3 minus 4. Negative 3 plus 4 is 1. Negative 3 minus 4 is negative 7. Hence, the values of x for this quadratic equation are positive 1 and negative 7. Thank you for watching. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. God bless.